this is the story of uh, the tooth fairy who took upon herself to go ahead and find the mass of teeth that she puts in a bucket here. And really this is a story of how do you go ahead and use Fathom to both go ahead and record the data so she might have something in her case where it's how many teeth does she have in the bucket versus what the mass is. And taking that to make a graph with data points and then fitting a line to it or a curve, in this case a line, and trying to get an equation for that. So something that will say mass equals and then something over here. That's the story that we want to go through right now. How do you do this in Fathom? Okay, let's go over to Fathom Okay, to start off, pull a collection down. A collection is a set of data. Right now you can see it's empty. To enter the data, pull down a table. In the table, let's type in the data. Next, add units. Right click Fathom understands different units. Next, let's make a graph. Make your graph nice and big so you can see the whole thing with lots of space. You can change the scale by pulling on different parts of the axis on the left hand side of the axis in the middle on the right. You can do the same thing on the y-axis. Next Take a look to see what your data looks like. Our tooth fairy guessed that her data was going to be linear because she had guessed that the mass was going to increase linearly with the number of teeth. So let's see how you add a function. Right click, choose plot function. Type in your equation. Notice that this equation is written like a physics physicist would write it, where it starts off mass equals because mass is on the y-axis. I typed in teeth. Notice that it matches the x-axis variable. Alternatively, you can do slope times and choose under attributes teeth and double click on it. At this point Fathom does not know what the slope is or what B is. You hit OK. Here's the equation. Not graphed because again slope and B are unknown. Let's tell Fathom what the slope and the y-intercept are going to be. The sliders, that's what these are called, give the values for the constants. Fathom sets them at some arbitrary number. Watch what happens when you adjust their values. Or you can type in a number. Right now, 
the graph is showing mass equals, and for the slope it's 5, mass equals 5 times teeth plus 5. Then adjust your sliders appropriately to fit your data. If you do not have a good scale on here, again, this is draggable. You can also hit Control, and it gives you a plus sign, and you can zoom in on one particular place to allow you a smoother adjustment. Adjust both numbers until it looks appropriate. That's how you go about figuring out the equation for a line. And as of right now, the equation of this line is mass equals 4.79 teeth plus 156. We'll talk more about units in another video.